A while back, God gave us a specific word. He said that he was gonna increase our calling to serve our community. And we started by setting up micro missions. And a big part of that is to also establish community ministries. We started by setting up the food warehouse that Hope Church runs alongside Transform for Bromley Borough Food Partnership. And we do all of this knowing God called us to be a witness and to share Jesus for his glory. Apostolic churches are marked by three characteristics. First of all, they carry in their DNA a passion for the gospel to advance. They send people on mission. Secondly, they have within their DNA a character of generosity. Their generosity with their lives, generosity with their time, but also with their finance. Thirdly, though, as well as holding the nations in their gaze, they transform the communities that they live in. The gospel at work in them, the generosity of the gospel in them, means that they not only bless their own community of faith, but also the wider community. Communities are transformed by apostolic churches, and Hope Church is a church such as that for the borough of Bromley and beyond. Often asked, how can Hope Church be a church for the whole borough and beyond if we don't have congregations in every part of the borough? Well, we believe it is through our engagement in community mission that we will reach the whole of this borough. And God has promised us, as we have sought to sow our lives into our community, that not only the gospel will advance, but the people of the communities we live in will experience both the passion and power of his love for them. As we entered lockdown, one of the questions that we asked, and I mentioned to us as a church previously, was wouldn't our profile diminish? But God promised us that in this season, our profile would increase and not diminish. And through the food project that Julian's about to talk to us about, you will see how the gospel has been made evident to our community. So the uh, Transform Bromley Borough Food Partnership is a God-given opportunity for us at Hope Church to bless the whole borough of Bromley. Over the last 13 weeks or so, we've given away approximately 26 tonnes of food through our 12 food partners, uh, churches that we are working with across the borough together with the Housing Association. We're currently in 12 of the 16 key communities within the borough and we're looking to increase this. We want to be uh, in Crystal Palace, we want to be in Biggin Hill, we want to be right across the craze too. We're partnering with 12 different organisations, mainly churches, one housing association to serve the people in real need across Bromley. And it's been an amazing joy as a church, as Hope Church, to service our whole borough in this way and raise the profile of the church across the borough, not just Hope Church. We're delighted to be working with Morrisons, with Tesco's, with Fair Share. And our real prayer is that the quantity of food that we receive will continue to increase. We're currently in negotiations, or will be shortly, with Sainsbury's. And our prayer is that organisation after organisation will give us what they don't need so we can give it to the people in Bromley who really need it. And we all know that as this crisis deepens, as times get harder for people who lose their jobs, uh, when furlough comes to an end, we can serve them, we can love them, we can demonstrate God's love to people in need through blessing them with the gift of food. That's what the Transform Bromley Borough Food Partnership is all about and it's why it's such a privilege and a joy to be involved in this work. We have been amazed how the Food Hub and our partnership with churches through Transform Bromley Borough Food Partnership has grown. And as Julian expressed, we believe that in this coming season, this project will not be a temporary project, but be one that will carry on, not through this year, but the years to come. We believe God's calling it to reach the whole of the borough of Bromley. And as we've been praying into this, we said, Lord, will you give us more opportunities to receive donations of food? Week by week, that is increasing. And even today, we received our largest donation of food from a supermarket. It's like God is going ahead of us and providing the materials to distribute. 
And we said, Lord, we also need leadership to steer this project. I would love you to pray that maybe one of you is called to lead on this project for us. Some of the funding from resources from this offering will go towards funding this post. And thirdly, we believe, Lord, will you give us a venue? We've been promised to be in high streets and places of prominence. And Gary's going to share now how we believe Alperton High Street is opening up for us. Tony's talking about big projects and how uh, God is blessing us uh, and also for us to be considering what God's calling us to in the future. Uh, and one of the issues we've got is the success, the way God has blessed uh, this whole food hub here at Orpington. Uh, this space uh, is not really fit for purpose any, anymore and it's uh, as God is blessing us. This is a Morrison's delivery. Uh, so much fresh uh, and in-date food to bless people around the borough and, and beyond in fact. So we're, we're needing to look for a new venue. So we had a meeting with uh, the Orpington business manager uh, and she is very, uh, very uh, accommodating and uh, like a woman of peace who is looking uh, for venues, helping us to look for a venue so that we can begin to free up the good mead and also we have to help uh, support this amazing project. I've already said that Hope Church is an extremely generous church. And as we knew that God called us to establish community ministry in the midst of the pandemic, we received a significant gift to enable us to begin that process. But you know, as we saw that money deployed to bless not ourselves but the community, we saw God abundantly give back to us from both within the community and government, match funding and beyond. And as we prayed into that, we know that is going to be the pattern of giving that we receive. As we give as a church to bless our community and not ourselves, God will release to us blessings from heaven, blessings from government, blessings from our community that they might experience the goodness of God. Back in January, we shared a vision for not just 2020, but beyond. And it included this that we felt Hope Church was called to be a church that would reconnect social action to God. That the, the gospel, the liberation is declared for the captive. And we have three themes within that, and the food project is the first of those. We believe there are more to come. And as we give in this new era offering, we believe resources and seed funding for new projects will be established. Here are some ways on how to give. The best way for us is by direct bank transfer. Please reference the new era offering. Alternatively, you can make a pledge. Again, please reference the new era offering. If you have any questions about making a pledge or you need the church bank details, please email david.dell at hopechurchuk.org. For all the other ways that you can give, please visit our website www.hopechurchuk.org forward slash new era offering.